Hi friends, in today's video, I will show you how to crochet a square pattern for blankets. I am using a 4 mm crochet hook size and a 3 ply yarn. First of all, make a slip knot. Then with the help of crochet hook, we would make chains. So make chain 1, chain 2, chain 3, chain 4, chain 5 and then chain 6. After making 6 chains, make a slip stitch into the very first chain to form a ring. Now make chain 1, chain 2 and then chain 3. These 3 chains will be counted as our first double crochet stitch. Now wrap the yarn around the crochet hook. Go into this ring of chain and then draw a loop. Pull the yarn through 2 loops first. And then pull the yarn through 2 loops. This is our double crochet stitch. Wrap the yarn again. Go into the ring and draw a loop. Pull the yarn through 2 loops. And then pull the yarn through other two loops to make a double crochet stitch. Now make double crochet 3 into the ring. Including first chain, we have a set of 4 double crochet stitches. Now make 4 chains for corner. Make double crochet 1. Double crochet 2, double crochet 3, and then double crochet 4, chain 1, chain 2, chain 3, and then chain 4 for the corner. Double crochet 1, double crochet 2. double crochet 3 and double crochet 4 again make 4 chains for the third corner of our square pattern and now make last set of 4 double crochet stitches double crochet 2 double crochet 3 and the last one is double crochet 4 now Pull the starting yarn strand a little bit and cut it with the help of cutter because we have woven this yarn end inside first round stitches. Now make chain 1, chain 2, chain 3 and then chain 4 and after that make a slip stitch into the third chain which is right here. Our first round is completed. We have to work into the chain 4 space of the corner. Make a slip stitch into the first double crochet stitch after chain 3. Then make a slip stitch into the second one. Then into the third one. And after that make a slip stitch into the chain 4 space. And now start the second round. Make 3 chains. Make double crochet. Again make a double crochet and then again make a double crochet including 3 chains. Now we have a set of 4 double crochet stitches. Make 4 chains and into the same chain 4 space of our corner. Make double crochet 1, double crochet 2, double crochet 3 and the last one is double crochet 4. Here make chain 1 and then chain 2. Now we will work into the next corner space of chain 4. Make double crochet 1, double crochet 2, double crochet 3, double crochet 4, chain 4, double crochet 1, 
डबल क्रोशिया टू डबल क्रोशिया थ्री एंड द लास्ट वन इज डबल क्रोशिया फोर सो मेक चेन टू एंड स्टार्ट वर्किंग इन टू द नेक्स्ट चेन फॉर स्पेस ऑफ आवर कॉर्नर रिपीट द प्रोसेस ऑफ मेकिंग फोर डबल क्रोशिया फोर चेन एंड फोर डबल क्रोशिया इन चेन फॉर स्पेस एंड चेन टू इन बिटवीन दैम एंड कम्प्लीट दिस राउंड सो आई हैव कम्प्लीटेड दिस राउंड नाउ मेक अ स्लिप स्टिच इन टू दी फर्स्ट डबल क्रोशिया स्टिच आफ्टर चेन थ्री दैन इन टू द सेकेंड वन एंड दैन इन टू दी थर्ड वन टू मेक अ स्लिप स्टिच इन टू द चेन फॉर स्पेस यू वुड चेंज द कलर मेक अ स्लिप नॉट ऑफ दिस यान फर्स्ट आई एम यूजिंग अ पिंक कलर यान नाउ अटैच दिस पिंक कलर यान बाय स्लिप स्टिच इन टू द चेन फॉर स्पेस कर द प्रीवियस यान स्ट्रैंड एंड मेक अ नॉट ऑफ दीज टू यान स्ट्रैंड आवर स्टिचिज एंड आवर वर्क वुड बी सिक्योर्ड बाय मेकिंग अ नॉट लाइक दिस वे Now make three chains, which will be counted as a double crochet in every round. Make double crochet three times, including three, chain three. We have four double crochet stitches here. Now make chain three. Sorry, chain four, and then into the same chain four space. Make double crochet one, double crochet two, double crochet three, and then double crochet four. Now we would work into the chain two space. Next, without making any chain, make double crochet one into the chain two space. Double crochet two. डबल क्रूशे थ्री डबल क्रूशे फोर एंड देन डबल क्रूशे फाइव आफ्टर मेकिंग फाइव डबल क्रूशे स्टिचेज इन टू दी चेन टू स्पेस वी वुड वर्क इन टू दी नेक्स्ट चेन फॉर स्पेस ऑफ आवर कॉर्नर सो मेक डबल क्रूशे वन डबल क्रूशे टू डबल क्रूशे थ्री And double crochet four. Then make chain four. And into the same chain four space. Again make a set of four double crochet stitches. For the corner. And after that. We would work into the chain two space next, without making any chain. So make double crochet one into the chain two space, double crochet two, double crochet three, double crochet four, and the last one is double crochet five. So repeat the process and complete this round till the end. So I have completed this round and I have made a slip stitch. Into the chain four space also, because we have to start work our next round into the chain four space. So make three chains, make double crochet three times to get a set of four double crochet stitches, and after that make chain one, chain two, and then chain three. After making three chains, make a single crochet. Into this chain four space. Then make chain one, chain two, and then chain three again. And make double crochet one, double crochet two, double crochet three, and then double crochet four into this same chain four space of our corner. In this round, corner stitches are bit different. Now skip these four double crochet stitches. Start working from the first chain of 
then first double crochet of chain 2 space make double crochet 1 then into the same double crochet make double crochet 2 into the next 3 stitches make simple regular double crochet stitches double crochet 1 in the second stitch double crochet 2 into the third stitch and double crochet 3 into the fourth stitch into the fifth stitch make double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 into the same stitch because this is our increasing stitch now work into the chain 4 space make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 double crochet 3 double crochet 4 make chain 3 1 2 3 make a single crochet into the same space make 3 chains again make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 double crochet 3 and double crochet 4 skip 4 double crochet stitches here start working from the first stitch of chain 2 space make double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 into it then into the next 3 stitches make simple regular double crochet stitches double crochet 1 in the second stitch double crochet 2 into the third stitch double crochet 3 into the fourth stitch fifth stitch is again our increasing stitch make double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 into this fifth stitch so repeat the same pattern till the end of this round so I have completed this round make a slip stitch into this chain 3 space now make 3 chains and into the chain 3 space make 3 double crochet stitches now make chain 1 chain 2 chain 3 and into the same chain 3 space make a single crochet like this now make chain 1 chain 2 and then chain 3 chain 4 chain 5 chain 6 after making these 6 chains make a slip stitch into the next chain 3 space right here make chain 1 chain 2 and then chain 3 again and into the same chain 3 make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 double crochet 3 and then double crochet 4 now skip these 4 double crochet stitches start from the next double crochet stitch make double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 into it because this is an increasing stitch now in these next 5 stitches make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 double crochet 3 double crochet 4 and then double crochet 5 in these 5 stitches without any increase now in the last stitch before the next corner here make double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 like this now skip the 4 double crochet stitches of the corner and start working into the chain, th chain 3 space make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 double crochet 3 and then double crochet 4 then make chain 1 chain 2 and chain 3 make a single crochet into the same chain 3 space then make chain 1 chain 2 chain 3 chain 4 chain 5 and then chain 6 make a single crochet into the next chain 3 space after the single crochet
make three chains again then make double crochet one double crochet two double crochet three and double crochet four into this chain three space so this is the pattern for the corner and here in this stitch and in this last stitch in between stitches make two double crochet and repeat the process till the end I have made a slip stitch in every double crochet stitch also till the chain spaces because in every round we would work into the chain space so I am changing the color and I have made a slip stitch into the chain 3 space with this changing color of yarn now cut the pink yarn and make a knot of these two yarn strands now start the next round with chain 3 and make 3 double crochet stitches into this chain 3 space also now cut these 2 yarn strands now we would work into the chain 6 space we have made right here make six chains and then go into the chain six space make an unfinished half double, uh, double crochet stitch wrap the yarn go into the chain six space draw a loop pull the yarn through two loops and leave the other wrap the yarn again draw a loop pull the yarn through two loops wrap the yarn again draw a loop pull the yarn through two loops repeat this process of making unfinished double crochet stitches five times and after that we have six loops on our crochet hook pull the yarn through all six loops together to make a double crochet five together make chain one chain two chain three chain four chain five and chain six start working into the next chain three space double crochet one double crochet 2 double crochet 3 and then double crochet 4 skip the 4 double crochet stitches start working from the 6th one make double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 into it in the next stitches except the last one make simple regular double crochet stitches and in this last stitch make two double crochet stitches double crochet one and then double crochet two start working into the chain three space of corner make double crochet one double crochet two double crochet three and then double crochet 4 then make chain 1 chain 2 chain 3 chain 4 chain 5 and then chain 6 go into this chain 6 space make unfinished double crochet 1 unfinished double crochet 2 unfinished double crochet 3 then unfinished double crochet 4 and unfinished double crochet 5 finish them together by pulling the yarn through all loops make chain 1 chain 2 chain 3 chain 4 chain 5 and then chain 6 and work in this chain 3 space make double crochet 1 double crochet 2 
डबल क्रूशे थ्री डबल क्रूशे फोर सो रिपीट दिस प्रोसेस विद द सेम प्रोसेस विद द सेम इंक्रीजिंग पैटर्न सो आई हैव कंप्लीटेड दिस राउंड नाउ मेक थ्री चेन्स एंड इन दिस चेन सिक्स स्पेस मेक डबल क्रूशे वन डबल क्रूशे टू एंड डबल क्रूशे थ्री आफ्टर दैट वी वुड वर्क इन टू दिस डबल क्रूशे फाइव टूगेदर स्टिच सो रैप दी एंड अराउंड द क्रूशे हुक टू टाइम्स गोइंग टू दिस डबल क्रूशे फाइव टूगेदर स्टिच ड्रा लूप पोल दी एंड थ्रू टू लूप्स फर्स्ट दैन थ्रू अदर टू लूप्स एंड दैन थ्रू अदर टू लूप्स टू मेक आर ट्रेबल क्रूशे और अ ट्रिपल क्रूशे स्टिच ना मेक ट्रिपल क्रूशे स्टिच सेकेंड टाइम इन टू दिस सेम स्टिच मेक टू चेन्स मेक ट्रेबल क्रूशे वन एंड देन ट्रेबल क्रूशे टू इन टू दिस सेम डबल क्रूशे फाइव टू गैदर स्टिच नाउ वर्क इन दिस चेन सिक्स पेस आफ्टर डबल क्रूशे फाइव टू गैदर स्टिच मेक डबल क्रूशे वन देन डबल क्रूशे टू डबल क्रूशे थ्री एंड डबल क्रूशे फोर स्किप दिस फोर डबल क्रूशे स्टिचेस स्टार्ट वर्किंग फ्रॉम द फिफ्थ वन एंड मेक टू डबल क्रूशे स्टिचेस इन टू दिस स्टिच रिपीट दिस प्रोसेस फॉर द कॉर्नर एंड इंक्रीजिंग स्टिचेस एंड कंप्लीट दिस राउंड सो आई है मेड ऑल स्टिचेस इन दिस राउंड नाउ मेक चेन वन मेक अ सिंगल क्रूशी इन टू द सेम चेन थ्री मेक अ सिंगल क्रूशे इन टू द डबल क्रूशे स्टिच आफ्टर चेन थ्री देन इन टू द नेक्स्ट डबल क्रूशे स्टिच आफ्टर दैट इन टू द नेक्स्ट डबल क्रूशे स्टिच हेयर वी हैव अ ट्रेबल क्रूशे स्टिच मेक अ सिंगल क्रूशे इन टू इट मेक अ सिंगल क्रूशे इन टू द नेक्स्ट ट्रेबल क्रूशे स्टिच आफ्टर दैट वी हैव चेन फोर चेन टू स्पेस सॉरी फॉर द कॉर्नर नेक्स्ट सिंगल क्रूशे वन सिंगल क्रूशे टू एंड सिंगल क्रूशे थ्री इन टू इट एंड लास्ट वन इज सिंगल क्रूशे फोर नाउ मेक अ सिंगल क्रूशे इन टू द नेक्स्ट ट्रेबल क्रूशे स्टिच देन अ सिंगल क्रूशे इन टू द नेक्स्ट ट्रेबल क्रूशे स्टिच देन अ सिंगल क्रूशे इन टू द डबल क्रूशे स्टिच सो दिस इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ मेकिंग सिंगल क्रूशे बॉर्डर अराउंड दिस स्क्वेयर पैटर्न सो आई हैव कंप्लीटेड दिस सिंगल क्रूशे बॉर्डर नाउ मेक अ स्लिप स्टिच इन टू द वेरी फर्स्ट सिंगल क्रूशे स्टिच Pull the yarn, cut it with the help of cutter, and remove the extra yarn strands. Now weave this yarn strand with the help of tapestry needle at the back side. So I have even the yarn end, and our square pattern is ready. I hope you guys like this tutorial video. If you like it, give it big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to get more videos. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.